do such a thing? Oh, my poor Alexandre. I come by every day to set my pocket watch. I saw the young man waiting over there, holding a bouquet of flowers. Then, bam! Very upsetting, as you can imagine. I did notice one thing. The cannon usually points in a different direction. We had a rendezvous. I arrived at the stroke of noon, and that cannon suddenly fired. He was instantly killed. As far as I know, he hadn't an enemy in the world. Looking. Oh, the murder. I feel sorry for the poor guy, but <laughs> it was a real show. Pretty much blew a giant hole in him. You know who you should talk to? Sergeant Sambri. He's the veteran loads that cannon every morning. Check Café Février. Table by the window. Last night, I did manage to wake up, and I swear I saw somebody fiddling with a cannon. Then he limped away. Cripple, I guess. Ah, conked out.
We need your help. I heard the shot and all the screaming. I'm the inventor of that cannon, you know. Quite ingenious, I think. Unfortunate business, the killing, but it will bring attention to my invention. someone sitting with the sergeant over there. As it happens, I recognize the man. I served under him as a fusilier, Colonel de Frolois. As it happens, I think I know the man from the army days. I don't recall the name, but I believe he became a scientist of some sort. He may actually work at the Collège de Quatre Nations. Damn it, I miss the old thing. Nah, otherwise today pretty much like any other. Unless you count the old colonel who come limping in early this morning, had a coffee with a the sergeant. They seem like old pals. I am Sergeant Sandry, veteran of the Corsican campaign. And I don't take kindly to jokes, young man. It is my honor and duty to load that damn solar contraption every damn morning. I load it with scraps of paper. Paper! Couldn't hurt a child. The day was a day like any other. Now, leave me alone. Vous êtes un voleur. C'est gentil de passer me voir, citoyen, mais à quoi dois-je ce plaisir Approchez donc, je vous montre. Regardez comme cela est déséquilibré. En ce qui me concerne, cela me gêne pas. Vraiment, le texte n'est même pas centré. Et qu'est-ce donc que ces majuscules C'est un effet artistique, un signe distinctif. Mais on ne met pas de majuscules en fin de mot. Cela n'a pas de sens, voyons. Moi, je trouve ça joli. Approchez donc, je vous montre. My time is much too important to answer impertinent questions. Address yourself to my aide de camp. Good morning. 
morning, citizen. I'm afraid that we cannot accept any more entries into the contest. However, you can still make a monetary pledge to the revolutionary cause. Just sign here. Whoever you are, take care to speak to citizen de Frolois with the greatest respect. He is a veteran of the Corsican campaign, and his military prowess is only matched by his scientific expertise in chemistry and ballistics. My time is much too important to answer impertinent questions. Address yourself to my aide de camp. It was a stupid mistake. My only thought was to disrupt an experiment. But I am the most deserving scientist. Just look at how ingenious was my plot. It was a stupid mistake. My only thought was to disrupt an experiment. But I am the most deserving scientist. Just look Any at Any fool could have figured that one out, I imagine. Still, take a weapon if you like. 